y'all. Bonus episode. Since our earlier hike was cut short due to the ticks, we drove a few kilometers away and decided to hike for a few hours here at the Nine Mile River Trails. I'm going to try Nine Mile River System, and there's actually people here because there's cars in the parking lot. <laughs> anyway, we want to stay clear of the ticks, so we're just yeah. going to try something easy this time. Yes. Check out, since we're already out here, and we had to abort the waterfall mission, um, Nine Mile River Trails. So I don't know which one we're going to go on yet here. We're going to see some people here today, because <laughs> we never see people on any of our hikes. But this is an actual trail, Nine Mile Trail, Nine Mile River Trail. hike. No ticks. As long as you stay out of there, I guess. <laughs> and no bugs. Unfortunately, we didn't get to see those waterfalls and we worked hard for those. We had to fight off like um, like a million bugs. As soon as we stepped out of the car, we were swarmed. And then a whole field of ticks tried to eat us. Tried to eat all our blood. Know where this trail really goes. Never been here before, but there seems to be a map coming up here. We just want to see if we can get um, close to the river on the trail, so we're at least walking by the water. You are here, so we'll follow the uh, yellow one until we get to the green one. <laughs> follow the orange. Oh, well, Mark, what are those yellow ones, I wonder? We followed red, now we're following orange. Nice following a little trail for once. Just saying, this is normally the kind of stuff that we were walking through on our hikes. This. This is like dessert. <laughs> it's like a real treat. <laughs> we're bad, we're bad, we're off the beaten path. I just wanted to check out. We came off the trail, cheaters that we are, just wanted to check out that little, I think it's a deer hunt stand, deer stand. We're in the woods, but we're going to get back into the trail here now. Back to the trail. We did, however, see some people on the trail. They passed by us just as we entered the woods, probably wondering what are those people doing? Because we never, never encounter people on our, on our journeys. Oh, here come those girls. 
that went in the parking lot, same time as us. I'm just going through. I got my phone char plugged into the pocket juice to try and charge it because it was uh, getting low. And uh, I can actually film and take pictures while it's charging, so this is awesome. Pocket juice. I can't get a picture of it. <laughs> It looks like the lake or the river is down there. But this is not the path. <laughs> this is not the way you're supposed to go. I'm just gonna have a peek. There's lots of footprints here though. Yeah. Ooh, and they're all in the mud. So that's obviously the route to get to the little beach area here. So we're off the beaten path, but we're not destroying any plants or vegetation here. It's just a muddy path. Down here. Wow, nice. bench here. Although there's not much of a view that way except to us it looks like tick grass and we're going nowhere near it <laughs> <laughs> after our earlier experience with that. Still following the uh, orange trail hoping it's going to meet with the green trail that's by the river. That's all we really know. It's not a bad path. It's a little bit muddy in parts. No, but it feels like we've walked probably at least two kilometers, maybe three, but Coming up to some signs. We're still on the orange trail. We're trying to get to the green trail because we want to get by the river. Uh, this is facing the opposite direction. And it says, very helpful for us right now trying to find a green trail. No horses on the trail. Oh. Okay. So if you get them all the way to here, <laughs> you go back. Go back. No horses thus far. So now we've got orange. There's those yellow markers. Yeah. We came from here, and we were trying to get to here, to green, and we walked all the way to here. How we did that, I don't know. But that's where we were down on the river. Yeah. That's where we went, no. It must have been. Must have, yeah. Make it to the river because we are just following the paths, but this brought us to this little tiny, just a little lake. So I think we're going to try and figure out how to get down to the river or back out. It's raining. Teepee. 
So, <laughs> we kept following the orange path and it's taken us off course twice. And we're not sure how that happened. So we're going to take it back the way we came and see if we can find either either of the <laughs> entrances to this infamous green path by the river. The path. Come down this uh, kind of road looking thing. Clearly not a green path or no green markers. We have no idea. It seems to be going in the right direction, but we'll see if it takes us to the river or not. Let's see if we can find another path down. This could be it, but we don't want to venture too much further because we're not sure. We figure we did four or five kilometers, trying to find our way back out, the trail here. We didn't find the little green trail along the riverbed, but we are going to stop by the riverbed for a few minutes and have a quick bite to eat before we head back up. So we sat and had some lunch, realizing that we actually were on the green trail and decided we'd explore just a little bit of the green trail after a bite to eat and uh, just kind of check it out a little bit. On the local swimming hole, a couple of rope. Here, <laughs> recent uh, get together. And back to the car after a great day of hiking. We think we added an extra seven or eight kilometers here. Head to the woods. I'm going to have supper, I guess. I hope you enjoyed this bonus episode of Terry Travels.